introduce you guys to Sam Viviano, who's been on a couple of our other. Uh, <laughs> Sam, say something so that you sort of pop up on people's uh, video. Okay, here I am. Hello. Sam, Sam was, um, was for, for many years, you could probably tell me how many, the art director 19. of Mad Magazine. 19 years, the art director of Mad Magazine. He drew and uh, some very amazing artwork. Uh, he is actually the fellow who I have commissioned to do the poster for uh, this show with with great uh, likenesses of all the characters. I loved it. I love it. Thank you. Uh, and and so so you see that you see that Sam <laughs> love it. Um, uh, but but Sam worked at Mad Magazine for a long time, and Mad had a bit of a connection to. And Sam, do you want to share with us? Uh, and the story of uh, of L.A. Law and Mad Magazine. Well, this came, up, this came up a little earlier with Susan. Now, Michelle, do you remember the Mad oh, yeah. Magazine? I have it. I have it framed. I have it. And okay, well, let me drawing, let me share it so everybody can see it. The drawing of me is so funny. It's like, look at do my face and that hair. Look. Okay, <laughs> oh, this is God. a cover of Mad Magazine by <laughs> Mort Drucker, the great. Mort Drucker, who uh, basically invented what a movie or television parody in Mad should look like. Yeah. <laughs> um, and uh, now this was before I was uh, act. Uh, certainly, I was before I was on staff at Mad. Um, I don't. I don't see. I don't have it in front of me now. Uh, so does it have the date on it, Dave? Uh, October 1987. 87. Yeah. So. I was working as an illustrator for Mad yet, but I was not as, as intimately involved. Now this came out uh, after the first season, I believe. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and so uh, I think that I, there's a question I do want to ask the two of you later, but um, anyhow, the, uh, the response was pretty wonderful. And this is something that has become a bit of Mad Magazine lore um, that in the mail, after the issue came out, the editor got this photograph <laughs> of the entire cast recreating the cover. <laughs> Uh, I like how Blair uh, Underwood says new guy. <laughs> yes, because he was not in the first season. And so he didn't appear in the uh, on the cover. I'll show you both of them together so you can see Compare how brilliantly cast. the cast recreated <laughs> Mark Drucker's cover right down to Stephen Boschko himself replacing Alfred as and the judge. Missing, and with a missing tooth. With the, with the mill, <laughs> yeah. tooth missing. And it, I don't know how well it shows up on the screen. Everybody signed it as well. Yeah, this is now a- We have one. this photograph up on the walls uh, in the New York offices of MAD right up until the day that we closed the offices at the end of 2017. <laughs> uh, this is really one of the, and every time we wrote a book about MAD, we had, had to include this because it was one of the, things that tickled everybody who was on staff, even those who had not been on staff at the time. And there's the cover. If you see that Susan Day is holding the, uh, in, in her yeah, she's briefcase, holding the man, yeah. holding the cover. Right, that's the copy that- uh, It's actually, so funny. Yes, it is, right, okay. Now, what I also like about this, given the, the specifics of tonight, is that Susan and Michelle are right next to each other. Yes, <laughs> I like I like the face that I'm making in the photo. That's like trying to copy that like hang dog expression on the cover. <laughs> well, that was that is the funny one. Uh, I, I think uh, Harry Hamlin also did try yes, to uh, recreate like, his expression, and Susan, yeah. you did too. Uh, this is a great, and somehow, uh, um, uh, oh, I'm, God, I'm blanking on his name. Uh, um, so Alan hugging his wife there. Oh, um, uh, Michael Tucker. Michael. Michael yeah. Tucker, yeah. Somehow he managed to grow much shorter just as he is on the cover <laughs> of uh, the magazine. <laughs>